Hello everyone out there in YouTube land and welcome back to my channel for a sort of impromptu video. Today we're going to be talking about <clears throat> holiday cards. Yes, it's that time of year when we send out holiday cards or at least I send out holiday cards and I think I really overdid it this year as far as my purchasing. There were so many cute cards at the Dollar Tree that I kind of went berserk and that's not even and those are just like the regular cards and then I have my my special cards and I get my whole lineup ready I get my phone book out I actually have a physical phone book um, that I have all the names and addresses of my friends plus I have all you guys out there in YouTube land to send uh, cards to so I have my um, I have my stickers and more whoa more stickers and then I got these which don't get these because they suck they come in a box of two three four five six seven eight stampers and you can't like you can't really tell what the hell they are that you can that you can't but when you stamp them I will show you they really well now now that I said that now they're working so when I was stamping them before they just look like I'll stamp the snowman for you it just looks like a blob like if I didn't tell you that that was a snowman would you know so every year I go through the same thing um, although this, I don't mean with the stamps, but like with the whole Christmas card thing, I send out before I started my YouTube, uh, family PO box thing, I would send out to friends, very few family that I have, um, friends, family, former school chums, former coworkers, um, I would send out maybe about 50 cards <clears throat> and every year I would say oh, I'm not gonna do this again because I send out 50 cards and I don't do it to get a card back but it's just really disheartening when you send out 50 cards and you get like two um, because you know like I took the time and the effort and the thought to remember you in my phone book and you know a lot of my addresses are not current which I have to fix but I took the time to think about you and send you a card and everything. And the least you could do is send a card back. Even if it's like a cheapy, like I have these boxes here. Uh, this is a box of 20 Christmas cards. Like send a cheapy card back. You know, is it so much of a big deal? So I always debate whether or not I'm going to send out cards. So this year... What I'm going to do is, I'm going to have my last hurrah, kind of. I'm going to try an experiment. I am going to send out Christmas cards to everyone. Uh, to everyone in my phone book. To everyone that has sent me something on YouTube. At least that I could read your address. I'm going to attempt this. Um, so I'm going to send out cards to everyone. I am going to bring a little bit of holiday joy to as many people as I can. And as I was thinking about how many people I send cards to, it amazes me how long I've been sending cards. There are people, like I, one comes to mind. I've been sending a Christmas card to a girl that I did an internship with way back in grad school. So that has to be like eight, nine, ten years ago. And I also have been sending a Christmas card to one of my college professors for like over ten years. And he's very sweet. And he sent me a card last year that said, I can't believe that we're still in contact after all these many years. And some of them I'm in contact with on Facebook. Most of them I'm in contact with on Facebook. But um, it amazes me how, like, I don't ever talk to these people. I don't really call them. I don't, well, I don't ever call them. Um, we don't have a relationship like that. But every year, I remind them, hey, 
I'm still here. I'm still thinking about you. Hope your life is good. And I think that that brings uh, a, a bit of happiness to people. You know, like, you know, every year you might not think about so-and-so in your daily life. But then at Christmas time, you get a card from that person and you say, hey, well, that's cool. They're, they're okay. They're doing well. And they hope I'm doing well, too. So I really, I really do um, think that there is a point to sending Christmas cards. Um, the other thing that's amazing to me is that we live in a digital age. So, you know, there are e-cards, but I don't believe in e-cards. I think that, I mean, do you guys send e-cards for holidays? I think you should send a regular paper card. I still send birthday cards to people. Um, yeah, I think it's nice to have a physical, tangible item. And I put all my Christmas cards on my mantle. And a lot of people throw out their Christmas cards after Christmas. I don't, usually. Um, some of them have gotten lost over time. But I put them in memory boxes. And I keep them. And sometimes I'll go through a memory box. And I'll look through and I'll pick up a card from someone. And be like, oh, that was nice that they sent that. So anyway, I'm going to get such writer's cramp this year and I don't know how much it's going to cost me in postage but I just thought I'd do this little video just to find out what you guys think about sending out holiday cards um do you think it's a good idea a bad idea is it a waste of time is it a waste of money um do you enjoy getting Christmas cards um do you go through the same thing as I do where you send out so many and you get so few in return um, and then the other thing is with sending Christmas cards to, uh, or holiday cards, I should say, to all of you out there in YouTube land, um, if I do make a mistake and send you a Christmas card and you are of another faith, I hope you'll not be offended. Um, and I usually, I try to send out, if, if I don't know what religion the person is, I try to just send season's greetings, uh, but the holidays are really far apart this year. Like Hanukkah falls on December 8th. And of course, Christmas is December 25th. And Kwanzaa is December 26th. And I'm sure there's many other religious holidays of other religions that I don't know. So if I send you like a season's greetings card closer to December 25th and you celebrate Hanukkah, then your card is really late. So what I'm going to try to do is I'm doing my Christmas cards now. I'm going to try to do a bunch each night and try to send them out soon so that whether you celebrate great luck, whether you celebrate Christmas, Kwanzaa, Hanukkah, wherever holiday you celebrate, that you will get it in time. Now, there are some YouTube family members that I may be sending a gift to. So if you get the card first and not a gift, don't think that you're not getting a gift. I may have just sent out the cards early. That looks terrible there. Look, a big giant pot and a spoon. So, and I was actually not even cooking in that pot. I don't remember the last time I used that pot. It was definitely before I moved in, but you guys who follow my channel, you know that my sink was broken for a long time. It cracked. And finally I got a new sink. And so when the guy came in to put the sink in, water was dripping. Like he had, I had a little bit of a clog. And so he had to like unclog it. And he said, I need something to catch the water. And that was what I had. So of course I super cleaned it, you know, um, if I ever plan to use it to eat out of or cook out of again. So that's why that's there. So yeah, I helped my mother do her Christmas cards today. So uh, I got writer's cramp from that. I did all of her Christmas cards today. Um, also, if you follow my channel, you know that my mother, she has a, a, she's disabled. She has a problem with her hand where she has a tremor. And so she can't, when she writes, it's really shaky. So she prefers that I write out her Christmas cards for her, and I totally do not have a problem doing that. So I'm like all Christmas carded out. I am 
not only do I Christmas card, but I make sure that I decorate and put a little Christmas flair in there. So I have other videos coming up that I'm going to be doing. I have another Dollar Tree haul, a small one to do. And the, can you guys hear that? That horrible noise? That's the steam coming up in my apartment. Like they always set the heat to broil here. I don't know why. So yeah, I have a Dollar Tree haul coming up. I have to do a friend mail because I did get friend mail. And... A whole bunch of other stuff, but I did want to tackle the Christmas card slash holiday card issue. So I'm interested in hearing what you guys have to say. Uh, leave me a comment down below if you like this video uh, and you know you're feeling kind of tired right now. Your Christmas cards, <laughs> leave me a comment. Anyway, that's all for this evening. Um, yeah. So subscribe and I will see you next time. Goodbye everyone out there in YouTube land.